Hello again everyone. Uh, today I have uh, I'm going to show you something about Buildcraft. So I've been working on recently uh, upgrading a bunch of old systems that have really needed some work for a while. One of which is the power system which you can see here. It doesn't really look all that different but it, it's a lot nicer than it was before. Uh, this is a new power pipe you can see here. Quartz pipes. They are mid-tier pipe. Move a decent amount of power. Uh, probably not as much as these lasers can use, but more than these engines are producing. Since the engines use 25 megajoules per tick each. But anyways, the real point of this video was I wanted to show you the advanced crafting tables. So, I don't know how many of you played with these, but the GUI is a little different than it was um, before. I split these two sections apart so that we have input and output. So, and we also, you'll notice that we have a table for each gear here. So you got the basic gear and the stone, stone to iron, and iron to gold. Now the cool thing is, is all I got to do is put some cobblestone in here, and it will start crafting those. And the next table will grab them, the stone gears. And they'll eventually end up over here, making gold gears. Get rid of that. Uh, see? The whole crafting chain from beginning to end. And it goes through that stack pretty quickly. And these lasers aren't even anywhere near fully powered. I got five engines here producing six megajoules a tick each. So 30 megajoules, which is really only enough to fully power a single laser. So this thing would be flying if we had more power. As you can see, it's turning this entire stack the gold gears. It actually will look in any adjacent inventory for ingredients like this one. Uh, put some cobblestone in there. And you'll see it'll start pulling cobblestone out. Um, okay. Oh, there's a little side bug there. Uh, I need to bump it up so it pulls out actually enough to craft the recipe instead of just one, apparently. But yeah, that's your general idea. Uh, this is uh, this would be mainly taking the place of the old uh, auto workbenches over here. Which uh, also recently got an upgrade. So they're quite a bit more limited now than they were before. But that's okay because these things are really cool over here. Anyways, uh, that's basically what I wanted to show you today. So I uh, hope you enjoy the uh, updates to build craft that have been coming down the pipe. So so to speak. Uh, again, dark here, so I think I'm gonna leave it at that. Catch you next time.